by changing the order of integration evaluate integral 0 to 1 integral y to 1 x by x square plus y square into dx dy so given integral 0 to 1 integral y to 1 x by x square plus y square into dx dy ok now the given integral from the given integral I am going to write out the given limit given limit so what is given limit x limit y limit so here one of the limit having the variable y therefore it is limit for x so x limit is y to 1 then obviously this is limit for y so it is 0 to 1 so now next I am going to find out the diagram this is x equal to y x is equal to y is a straight line so that take x axis and y axis the equation is x is equal to y x is equal to y is straight line passing through the origin so this so this is y equal to x ok now and this is x equal to 1 so this is x equal to 1 and this is also y equal to 1 you can draw ok so now I am going to draw the strip x is the variable limit so that I am going to draw horizontal strip this horizontal strip must start from the y equation and end with the x equal to 1 so here I cannot draw because if I draw horizontal strip here it is start from the axis so it must be 0 but here given y given y mean it should be start from the equation so the horizontal strip must be here so here this is the horizontal strip why I am drawing horizontal strip means x limit is variable this horizontal strip start from the equation end with 1 so start from the equation end with 1 so now by change of order of integration this horizontal strip I want to change into vertical strip so this horizontal strip I am going to change into vertical strip for this vertical strip I am going to write out the limit so change of limit so change of limit so what is change of limit I am going to find out the limit for the vertical strip x limit y limit but I am putting a vertical strip means y limit is variable x limit is constant so y limit variable means it is the strip start from the axis so it must be 0 to the strip end with the equation from this equation y is equal to x so that it is x so after obtaining the y limit but x limit is should be constant because y limit variable so x limit constant constant means it is origin 2 x is 1 y is 1 so this point must be 1 comma 1 so x limit is 0 to 1 so now I want to evaluate the given integral for this change of limit ok so this is the given limit, given integral I am this given integral I want to evaluate by using this change of limit so now integral the given integral is x by x square plus y square but I want to use the change of limit what is change of limit y limit is 0 to x first I want to write the variable limit so y is variable limit y limit is 0 to x so that it is 0 to x so that y is the y is the variable limit means y is the first integral dy and dx now next x limit is 0 to 1 so here 0 to 1 so here the first integral with respect to y so treating x as a constant so 1 by a square plus x square integral dy by a square plus y square is equal to 1 by a tan inverse of y by a so this is the formula this formula I am going to use here here instead of a we are having x so that integral 0 to 1 take this x here 1 by a square plus y square by the formula 1 by a tan inverse of y by a after integrating this the limit for y is 0 to x into dx are you clear so comparing these two formula here integration with respect to y here also integration with respect to y but instead of a square we are having x square 
so 1 by a tan inverse of y by a so 1 by x tan inverse of y by x so now this x this x cancel so that integral 0 to 1 tan inverse of y by x whose limit is 0 to x into dx ok now I am going to put the limit substituting the upper limit x by x is 1 so tan inverse of 1 minus substituting the lower limit tan inverse of 0 into dx but tan inverse of 1 is pi by 4 into 0 to 1 pi by 4 minus tan inverse of 0 is 0 into dx so this is pi by 4 is a constant can take outside integration of dx is x whose limit is 0 to 1 substituting here 1 so final answer is pi by 4 so this is the answer of the problem